Hello awesome people, welcome to Smartphone Tutorials and this topic is coming after a few days, precisely after two weeks. That's correct, uh, we've not done any flashing routing but then again, guess what? This week is going to be exciting and we're going to flash a lot of custom ROMs on the OnePlus 5T, on the Xiaomi Redmi 4A and stuff like that. There is also going to be a real life ROM review for the Lineage OS 15.1 which we're going to flash in this particular video. So this particular video is about flashing Lineage OS 15.1 official for the OnePlus 5T. This will be an install and preview. Now as of now while we are shooting this particular intro we are on oxygen os 5.0.4 i thought that i should review this update but then again the changes are very very small for me to make a complete review out of it if you still want me to make a review out of it let me know in the comment section if i get enough comments on it i will make a full review of oxygen os 5.0.4 and before we begin if you've not already Check out the latest giveaway that we have. There's a chance to win a brand new Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. And at the same time, like, share and subscribe if you haven't already. Without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. Let the flashing begin. All right, so it's time to install Lineage OS 15.1. Now this is an official ROM and uh, I've been trying to install it since a few days, but because of different versions of Google apps, I've been uh, facing a lot of uh, force close issues here. But finally, I have the latest uh, Pico version, which seems to work fine. So uh, yeah, uh, you need to be on an audio based ROM already. I don't see a reason why you should be on Nougat at this point of time, especially when the stable and beta both for th this device are uh, based off Android 8.0 audio. Anyways, uh, so what we will do first is we will go to TWRP. And if you don't know how to install TWRP, if you want to know, uh, there's a card at the top, so tap that video to unlock your bootloader and install TWRP. And then uh, just copy the files to your phone's internal memory and go to wipe, advanced wipe, Dalvik cache system data. We won't be wiping internal storage. So then we will go to install, lineage OS, add more zips and open Google Apps. We're going to wipe cache in Dalvik and then reboot system to not install. All right, so that's what we have here. Let me just increase the brightness a little bit for you guys. Looks better. Definitely, yes. So looking at the app drawer, you don't have much. You have the gallery and some basic apps, including the camera. Uh, I'm expecting that the camera app would be the same as uh, the one it was, uh, you know, on Candy ROM. Um, let's go to settings here. Yes. So it again says finish setup and uh, is there any particular customization option? So as I said, uh, you know, it's a pretty, pretty bare bones ROM is what we have here. You have an option to customize your status bar, the quick pull down and stuff like that. And then you have gestures. You can use fingerprint gestures as well, touchscreen gestures and stuff like that. So uh, the funny part is it is in system and language and input buttons and all can be customized. Now, apart from this, if you have a look at the settings menu, it is very, very plain. There's nothing much that is included here. And uh, once again, let's just test the camera. Yeah, so it's the same app. I'm pretty sure uh, portrait mode would not be working. So yes, it's the same camera that we have. Uh, and uh, to sum it up, you know, there's nothing much that I have to show you guys. So that was the install and preview for Lineage OS 15.1. Now this is the official nightly, the first nightly that had come out. And uh, the camera, yes, it can do a basic job, but the quality is not that great. Portrait mode is not working. Uh, you know, the brightness issue is there. So don't worry about this ROM at least because uh, this won't be a short preview from tomorrow for the next three days you will see uh, day one, day two and day three of uh, real life ROM reviews. Day one would be first impressions with the ROM, day two would be performance and benchmarks and gaming and day three would be camera and uh, the conclusion. So stay tuned for those videos and if you like this video like, share and subscribe and don't forget to participate in the giveaway so that you can win or you can at least stand a chance to win a brand new Redmi Note 5 Pro and while you're subscribed hit that notification bell icon. Once again, thank you for your time. Nice speaking to you guys. Goodbye.